Greetings and salutations, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome back to the channel. In this video, I'm going to be going through the 1.8.0 patch notes for the finals. Now, honestly, I think this is a little bit disappointing. I was hoping for a little bit more from this, so it's going to be very, very brief. I'm not actually going to read through absolutely everything here because it's all like super, super minor stuff. I'm just going to mention the stuff that's like a little bit noticeable. So the first of those things is that there is going to be, I'm not actually going to read the patch, patch notes at all. If you want to go and read like the full patch notes, you can, um, but I'm not going to do that just again, because like there's really just not that much here, even though it's, it's quite long. Um, I'll read the first bit though. Join BR Valentine. Join the Valentine's Day event to unlock a series of precious rewards. Turn in contracts to earn all six unlockables. Don't play alone. Share the love and invite your soulmates to join your party. The Steal the Spotlight event has now been concluded thanks to everyone who participated and filled out the contracts. As promised, this update introduces some changes for nukes and snooks. Red canisters will now have the physics to make overloaded cans drop faster and take less predictable pathways. We've also removed the accidental double explosion and stacking damage from barrels with attachments. This patch features improvements to input latency on Xbox, new social notifications, and more. So that's pretty much it. The only other minor noticeable thing that's kind of good is that cloaking sounds will now differentiate between team members and enemy players and headshots will be indicated with their own sound. So that's pretty much it. So C4 barrels nerfed again. The red barrels only, not all of the other barrels, just the red barrels to put them in line with the other barrels. And then also cloaking sounds are now different for teammates and enemy players and headshot sounds, headshots have sounds now, apparently. Um, so that's all of the stuff, and obviously this is the skin that is in the store. It's not going to be like the Steal the Spotlight event mode, though, because that had its own specific event mode for unlocking stuff. In this, you just do, you play normal games to unlock stuff. I guess I can actually just alt-tab to this, and this is all of the rewards for the event, I suppose. So there's like a head thing, a weapon charm, and a moat. Uh, I guess that's a sticker. This is probably another sticker, and then there is a jacket as well. Um, and the, I'm just seeing if these are difficult or not. Block a total of 3,500 damage. Complete six successful catches with your team. Damage six opponents while sliding. Revive a teammate. Get 45 eliminations or assists. Assists. Restore a total of 1,000 health to teammates with a healing beam. So it's not the most difficult thing ever. Like 1,000 health is only like healing five teammates really. Back to full anyway, you know. So it's definitely not the most um, like, it's definitely not very, very grindy. You can probably complete this quite easily. But this is pretty much the extent of this update, which is very, very disappointing, especially since in the last update, like, there was also nothing. There was, like, really, really not so much in the last update either. They kind of just said, hey, we're going to fix C4 barrels in the next update, you know? I didn't even make a video on it for last week, actually. Um, so this definitely is a bit disappointing. They definitely seem to be better with their updates um, a while ago, they kind of did like a noticeable improvement, like once a week or at least once every two weeks. But now this has been the second week without any changes at all. Um, and I, I don't think that that's fantastic. So it definitely is a little bit disappointing. Um, but hey, we've got new stuff to grind for in the shop, which is always good. Like they definitely give up a lot of free stuff, um, which is quite interesting. Not many companies or games do do that. But this is like one of the other like free things that you can just go and get in the game if you go and grind for the event or whatever like the steal the spotlight one as well so this is kind of good um but yeah there's definitely not much to the update and therefore that's pretty much going to be it for this video because there's just like i can scroll through this and you can pause it and you can read it on your own but i'm just i'm not going to read through all this because it's very very mega minor stuff um but yeah so there you go, that is pretty much it, just because it's like a mega mega small, semi underwhelming update, I would say, but at least they did fix the C4 barrels, which was still a major issue. So from now on, you're probably not going to get killed by a heavy from out of nowhere, you're probably going to actually be able to see them first before you die, which is good. Um, but yeah, there you go. Thank you so much for watching, ladies and gentlemen, that is going to be it for this video. If you liked it, leave a like, subscribe, and I will see you in the next one. Farewell.